Hi guys, so um, I'm just doing a collection video just showing you my comic collection. Um, it's nothing really special right now. I've only been collecting about, I don't know, probably about between four and six months. Um, it's nothing, I mean, that's quite a bit of time, but I haven't really put too much money into it. Um, I haven't had enough money to put, buy a load of books, but um, I'm adding to the collection gradually and hoping that um, by picking up a few more hours at work and stuff, I'll be able to improve it. So I'm just going to show you what I've got so far. Um, so yeah, let's go. I don't have a huge amount. I've got like a short box, short box and a half, but we'll go through some of the stuff i got. So we've got Batman Beyond, Volume 1, Number 1. Got that again. Some special one of it. Number 2. Number 2 again. 3. Four, five, five again, and I'm missing number six of that. They're very hard to find, actually, them ones. I need to get number six to complete that run. Um, I've got volume one of, no, number one of volume two, signed. Volume, uh, volume two, number six, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 15, 16, uh, 17, 18, 19, I've got 19 again, um, 20, 21, 23, uh, that one's been really hard to find actually, it's very hard to find any of that stuff, the early sort of stuff of it. Um, because there's 24 in Volume 2, and I'm finding it hard to track down the ones I'm missing. I've got Batman Beyond Return of the Joker. That's basically the film in the comic book. Um, I'm a big fan of the Beyond universe, so that's why I've got all this stuff. Superman Beyond, one shot, zero shoe. Um, then we move on, I've got AVX stuff. Uh, we've got zero, blank one, uh, Midtown Comics Baby Variant one, Regular two, three, four, five, six, seven, uh, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve, and then we got the um, one short A babies versus A babies versus X babies, and then we've got the AV, AVX versus mini series. We've got the whole run of that. That was a cool series. Um, and then I've got the consequences stuff as well. All of those in there. And I picked up the first few issues of A plus X, which was all right, but um, it wasn't really. It didn't interest me that much. I got up to number five, but it was a bit. It wasn't a huge hit on me. Um, hit Girl. Uh, two. Three. Four. This was... This has just ended recently. But um, number five didn't come out for ages. I remember it was on my pull list and it didn't come out for ages. Um, Amazing Fantasy 15. It's not the first one. It's a reprint. Uh, if I had the first one, I'd be... First copy of it, first print, I'll be pretty happy. This is just a reprint, I got it um, because of reprints Amazing Fantasy 15 and Amazing Spider Man number one. So it's a cool little thing to read. Um, it's not worth anything, but it's just cool to have. Um, then I've got Amazing Spider Man 47. Um, I'm a big fan of Craven the Hunter, he's probably one of my favourite characters. I don't know why, just from a kid when I watched the show. Um, 75, 200. 209, 250, 252, I'm trying to get a run from 250 to 300, um, 253, 254, 255, and then I go all the way to 296, and I've got 300, nice mile, mylar, 
Um, that's my favourite comment. That's probably my most valuable one. Um, this is just a random one. Um, then I've got the 50th anniversary special. Then the um, the last run of it, the last story arc, just because I picked it up because you know Spider-Man was ending, so you got to get that. There's 700 there. Um, and then I got this, which is really good. If you didn't read the last story arc, just pick this up um, because it basically explains it all there, which is good. Um, Superior Spider-Man number one. I have all of those, but this is just some other stuff. It's a Craven the Hunter story, the Craven's Last Hunt. Um, so yeah, it's that stuff there. I think I've got all of those now. Yeah. Um, some cool Scott Young variant of Venom, which I picked up. It's pretty cool. 50th anniversary Spider-Man edition. Pretty cool. Scott Young does really good stuff. And uh, what if the Hunter had killed Spider-Man? Um, again, big Craven Hunter fan, so I just picked that up. Moving to some, I think this is mainly Marvel now stuff. Uh, we've got Avengers number one. This is the Gangnam Style variant of Deadpool. Uh, point one. Destructible Hulk one, two, three. I couldn't really get into this that much. Um, wasn't, so I dropped it. Uh, Fantastic Four one. I just picked up a load of the number one issues of everything, really. Just because I thought that would be cool to have them. This was one I got free when I went to uh, the London Super Comic convention which was cool um, there's some of my baby variants this is probably the best one I think the Fantastic Four or well, the Captain America one was pretty cool Four, Hulk Iron Man FF uh, Marvel Zombies Halloween that was a cool it's a shame it's a one shot that would have been cool as a continued thing Deadpool Kills the Marvel Universe number one. Um, I haven't got all of these. I read the trade. It's awesome. Um, I want to pick up the rest, but they're really hard to find or really expensive. So, uh, Deadpool Kills Straight number two. I need to get number one of that. I've got number three and number four. Iron Man 99. These are just some random Iron Man stuff. Uh, 157, 158, 159, 389. And then I've got some Civil War. Uh, four and five. And behind that, I just got some miscellaneous stuff that's random. Well, some DC stuff. So, Detective Comics 16, cool cover. And um, that's not mine, that's my brother's. But it's Batman number one. I got some spare Batman comics. I got from six to eleven. But yeah, um, then I picked up Batman Incorporated number eight. Uh, R.I.P. Damien, that was cool. Um, just some Simpsons stuff. You got up to 200, yeah, not many. Star Wars number one, um, Reddit, wasn't a fan. I mean, it's not that it was bad, it's just I can't read Star Wars in comic version, I have to watch the films. I'm weird like that. These are some free stuff I got at the London Super Comic Convention. Um, this is like a fourth printing of The Walking Dead 100. I don't know why I bought it, it was random. This I got free. Um, Bench Times, Batman, just some random stuff. They're not really worth anything, just random. Then this is my current stuff. So I got Justice League of America, number one, number two, Age of Ultron, number one and two, number three's on its way. Um, we got Gambit, we got one, two, three. Four of the original miniseries, and then I got picked up the latest series, which was a bit disappointing. It was all right, but it just felt like I was reading James Bond or something like that, rather than mutant. So um, yeah, I dropped that. Although I'm up to number eight, so I'll probably get nine and ten, just so it's a nice number. Um, Green Lantern 0, 1, uh, 13, 14, 15, and 16. I intend to fill in the gaps there. Um, I've got two and three ordered, so they should come soon. Avengers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. And we've got Superior Spider-Man, number 1. Two, number three, number four, number five, 
and number six. This is a good book actually. Um, still miss the old Peter Parker Spider-Man, but it's it's pretty good. Um, Iron Man one, two, three, four, five, and six. And oh, seven. This is a good book, actually. It's got really good. Um, I suggest you read it. Um, all new X Men. This is fantastic. This book. I've got the entire run. Three, four, five, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then we go to Batman. So I've got zero, one. I've got all of these. Two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and we've got the annual. That's a good book, actually. Um, so we've got some more Batman Beyond stuff. I think this is volume three. I've got one, two, three, four. Five, six. I got all of those, and then we got Batman Beyond Unlimited. Um, this is a new series. It's one, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. I don't actually read them because they're really confusing. So I'm just waiting for the trades because they're so confusing. There's like three stories in each book. By the time you get to next month. You don't know what the hell you've read. Um, Bedlam, this is a really good series. Um, I've got all of them. A uh, really good series, that is. Uh, I suggest anyone to pick up the trade when it comes out, if you haven't really picked up the books. Very good um, non-superhero book. I like it. Anyway, yeah, so that's my small collection. Um, hope you enjoyed it. And just kind of wanted to do this so that I can look back and see what my collection was and then in six months to a year's time I can be like oh, okay I've added to it and I can see what good I've done to it but yeah so thanks for watching please uh, rate comment and subscribe